Gateway College is bringing back another sports program, this one after 17 years. And today the school is officially bringing in its first recruiting class. TV20's Ethan Badowski tells us about the program's return in tonight's Columbia County report. It's really good to kind of build it from the ground up and kind of move forward with everything. At Florida Gateway College, a long dormant program is rising from the dust. After 17 years, softball is making its return to the school in 2024. It's the fifth program FGC has brought back since restarting its athletic department. Right now, we're really excited. We got a, a kind of hub of activity going on, a bunch of construction on the softball side, and uh, we just released the, the first recruiting class, 17 players. The school made its first recruiting class official today, and it taps into a low pool of talent close to home. 13 of the 17 players that will fill this dugout for Florida Gateway College are from North Central Florida. I spoke with one of them who's from right here in Lake City and played softball for Columbia High School. She told me the Timberwolves will not be phased by the challenge of being a brand new program. I've seen some of the people that were uh, signed and I know a few of them and these are some very confident girls, very good girls to come for the first class, which I think I'm very confident in this class. The pack will be led by Chastine's former Former coach at Columbia, Jimmy Williams, who won the 2013 state championship with the Tigers. No nonsense. He'll tell you as it lies. Um, you know, he's not going to sugarcoat it. And I appreciate that honesty in a coach. And that's one of the things what I like so much about him. The softball complex is currently 60% complete and first pitch is scheduled for spring 2024. In Lake City, Ethan Badowski, TV20 News.